So this is what the uh, the whole beta is about. <laughs> uh, there's train cars everywhere. This model didn't even get replaced and it got yeeted. Well, that's a bit of a mess. Well, the Class 70 is still on the rails. What's up, guys? This is Heiss. And today I've got a pretty big announcement for you guys. And that is that I'm actually going to be leaving Railroads Online. At least in the capacity of community manager and developer. Before everyone runs and gets pitchforks, uh, know that this is mostly a personal thing for me and, and I still want to see the project succeed. You've probably noticed lately that we haven't played the hardcore map. I haven't been active on the Discord. I haven't really posted videos about Railroads Online and that's just because... Life has just been really, really busy these days. I'm thankfully going to be moving to Colorado to start working at the Colorado Railroad Museum once again, full time. But the transition to get there, dealing with tying things up at my house in Seattle, cleaning things up, getting all that figured out, and then moving and packing everything up, uh, it just takes a huge amount of time because, I mean, the, the house is a bit of a project and everything, and there's a lot to finish up. So I haven't really had the extra time to focus on being a community manager or being a developer. And so with that, I think it's time for me to step down, particularly as community manager from that aspect, because I haven't been able to be there for you guys and I haven't been able to help support the moderators or get the junior moderators upgraded to full time moderators itself so I think it's going to be better if someone else can take over that aspect for me and as far as the dev side goes uh, I provided QMA with the soundtrack and some sounds and those will still be sticking around in there but I've always wanted to be closer involved on the development side of things than I can be and it, I don't think I'm ever going to get what I want out of helping with railroads online because I have background in programming and I have background in sound design and all that and it's just not really possible to do those things with the way that Railroads Online is set up. So more fun things to come on that front in the future so make sure you stay tuned. Wink, wink, wink. But uh, that, that's kind of where that's coming from. But the soundtrack will stay at the game so all the sounds are provided. None of the stuff is leaving. It's just time for me to go my own way, be able to focus on getting my moves squared away to Colorado, and then I want to be able to focus on my music and the YouTube channel itself and focusing on those things rather than also focusing on attempting to run the communication for Railroads Online, which is considerably challenging. The, the good news on that front, though, is that QMA says that he is going to be a bit more active with you guys in the community. He's planning on doing some live stream type stuff as well as more weekly posts from himself. So rather than getting a watered down version of what questions I answered with a game of telephone in the middle, he'll actually be able to hear from QMA himself about the progress of the game. And that'll be good and help keep things a little bit more clear. As well, the roadmap is well on its way. We've discussed it with weekly meetings the past couple weeks. Uh, and we've got a, a good structure working out, and it should be released within the next couple of weeks. But that's not going to be for me to be a part of. I'm going to let those guys take care of that and the posting of the roadmap. I was hoping I was going to be able to get it finished for you guys first before I left. But the timing's just not working out, and it, it's time for me to move on my way. Don't think of it as me saying goodbye. I still love Railroads Online. I'd love to see what's going to come with the game. It's still a super fun game and has built this really fun community of wonderful people together and introduced me to a lot of wonderful people that I love to work with. So we'll still probably have videos about Railroads Online on the channel. We'll still play the game, still have fun with it, but I'm just not going to be taking that close-handed role that I was trying to take previously. So I hope you guys can understand that and where I'm coming from and, and know that the game is still going to progress just as it was with or without me uh, as I didn't really have impact on the dev schedule itself. So anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys understand and we'll see you all next time. And make sure you keep your eyes out for what I was mentioning earlier. That'll be pretty exciting down the road. Thanks for watching.